A warm welcome to the 51st graduation ceremony of the Namibia University of Science and Technology. By virtue of the powers vested in me, I hereby constitute this gathering as the congregation of the Namibia University of Science and Technology. Next is PhD. First of its kind, no? drive through. Yes. Hey, yes, sir. Yes. Hey, 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 hey. I've done it right. You've done right, it right. At the right moment. Oh, I feel extravagant. It's been such a tough journey, but I'm so happy that we made it in the end. And today we can celebrate all of okay. that. Okay. Yes. Well, Thank when you. are you going to for the photos? I'm, 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 I'm just after them, so I'm going after them. Okay. Yes. All right. Okay. okay. So Thank sorry. you. No problem. It's very exciting, and I'm very excited. I'm therefore elated that this is a hybrid graduation ceremony that includes both an in-person component and a virtual aspect. The decision to have the event in this format is predicated on our desire to involve the graduates. There is a two-fold reason for this. Firstly, NAS is a student-centered institution of higher education. And secondly, a graduation ceremony is not the same if we do not have in the limelight those for whom we have gathered, namely those graduating here today. Congratulations all over. It's a two, the graduate day, it's my friend. It's your friend. Yes. Isn't it wonderful to see you there? Yes, I'm so excited for her. I'm so happy for her. That is wonderful. So what is the advice that you would give her as she goes into the industry basically now? I'm just go higher and give up.
And it's always good to have loved ones around you and then all the glory and respect goes to God, definitely. Always, always. But thank you so much. Enjoy your day. We'll thank see you what you can deliver on the red carpet. I would like to congratulate all the graduates for reaching this milestone. This qualification is not for you, but for your families, your communities, and for Namibia. Please make it count. The moment is yours. Go ahead and open the door. The time is now. We go paint the town red and gold. Feels so incredible. Head to toe. Thought that I should let you know, huh? Yeah, I'm screaming from the rooftops. I'm so excited about this. In fact, I'm so privileged that we get to experience this kind of event because I know it wasn't present at the June July graduation. So I'm just happy to be proud of this, to be part of this. Red and gold feels so incredible. Head to toe. Thought that I should let you know, huh? Yeah, I'm screaming from the rooftops. Old shoes, but I got a pair of new socks. Moonwalk across, yeah, I'm too hot. Made it all the way to the top from out of the boondocks. Yeah, and I'm flying up, up and away now. I'm rising, let it take me away. Feel like shouting. Made it to the top of the mountain, we've been climbing. And I love the taste and the feeling when the sunshine hits your face. The moment that you finish the race and everything falls into place. Yeah. As we celebrate your graduation day, I have one request for you. Before the day ends, send a text to somebody and say thank you. It could be a taxi driver, a neighbor, a relative, a friend, an ex-friend, even an ex-boyfriend or an ex-girlfriend who bought you a meal or gave you a $20 when you didn't have. Say thank you to someone who doesn't expect it. I also want you to encourage someone else to start studying or to finish their studies. The fifth lesson is really that. It's about the importance of being kind to others and having a grateful, a grateful heart and a teachable spirit. Ultimately, you reap what you sow. The fruits of gratitude and kindness take long to grow, but they are sweet and nourishing when they do. The seeds of entitlement, resentment, and anger multiply into small, bitter fruit, which ultimately poisons whoever grows them. Congratulations! Thank you so much! How are you doing? I'm doing awesome, thank you! One thing I always told my brother, not to give up, and my family, friends, colleagues, that always supported me. She's my niece, and I'm very much proud of her. Whatever she put in her mind must come out. Yeah, definitely. So, PhD, like how you feeling today? I'm feeling good. Probably it's like making a first time you've heard it for today. Not yet. It's not, not. Wherever you are, or wherever you find yourself on this memorable day. Take a moment, pause, and reflect. But most importantly, be celebrated. And thank yourself 